One of the reasons we bought our RV was so we could explore the great outdoors with Ghost here. But we were disappointed when we'd go bicycling and have to leave him behind. We'd seen people pulling little pups in those doggy trailers, but Ghost here weighs close to 90 pounds. My research confirmed that most of those trailers really are for smaller pups, but I did find one from PetSafe that's rated for dogs up to 110 pounds. This picture on Amazon helped convince us it was the right choice for Ghost. Putting the chariot together really is pretty simple. Now that I know what I'm doing, we can be underway in no time. But we chose to start slowly because we knew there would be a learning curve for both Ghost and for me. First, we needed a harness with an attachment ring on the chest so he could be strapped in and still stand or sit comfortably. We really didn't have much trouble getting him into the carriage. Give him enough treats and he'll do about anything. Then, I just walked the bike while Sheila distracted him with more treats. After that, I just rode slowly around the block a few times. All right, here we go. Letting Ghost run for a while is the most important lesson we learned. I gotta tell you, it is a lot easier pedaling when he is running beside than when I am carrying an extra 100 pounds. He starts out on the leash, but if there isn't anybody around, we let him run off leash. And Ghost seems a lot more relaxed now that he's run a little bit, so I guess we're learning as we go. Another thing I learned, don't wear clip-on or clip-in shoes because you never know when you're going to have to make a quick exit. Now that we've literally been around the block a few times, we're settling into smooth riding. Yep, hop right in. But there were some early bumps. Or should I just say, learning experiences. Okay, here we go. On away. Like his first ride, when he jumped out of the moving chariot because we didn't have the right harness. Then there was the time I took a turn too sharply and tipped the buggy. Thankfully, neither of us was hurt. This is fun, but I sure wouldn't want to do it on the Hilly 100. For us, the pet safe chariot was the perfect decision. Now we can enjoy biking as a family. With all his running and my pulling, we're both pooped at the end of the day. For Pet Pals TV, I'm Steve Schweitzer.